Let's start our next topic East West Asymmetry. By using cosmic ray detector, it has been found that the number of particles arriving from the west per second is greater than from the east. The first experimental evidence was observed by Johnson and Street on the summit of Mount Washington at latitude of 56 degree. Primary rays are charged particles. The effect of magnetic field of the earth on their motion will be a function of their mass, their charge, their velocity, the intensity of the field, the relative direction of the field and the trajectory. This effect is maximum at equator where the excess is 14%. The east-west effect shows that a majority of particles in the cosmic ray are positively charged. According to Fleming's left-hand rule, it is seen that the particles are deflected toward the east and thus appear to come from the west. The topic of this series is origin of cosmic rays. It was supposed in the beginning that the cosmic rays originate from the sun, but the cosmic rays intensity was found to remain constant at all hours of the day and night. Hence, we assume that only small fraction of cosmic ray particles come from the sun. Origin of majority of primary cosmic ray mainly based on three theories. Our own galaxy and other galaxies, interstellar space, Big Bang Explosion Theory. Let's talk about our own galaxy and other galaxies theory. According to Fermi, our galaxy, the Milky Way, is a source of cosmic rays. Some stars like supernova undergo explosion once in 250 to 300 years and throughout stellar matter. Next is interstellar space theory. Observation on the polarization of light from the stars indicate that the interstellar space is not a vacuum. It contains cloud of protons. These clouds move through the space with average velocity 30 km per second and rise to magnetic field in the interstellar space. Protons are accelerated in these magnetic fields and acquire extremely high energies. Third one is Big Bang Explosion Theory. The universe started with the Big Bang which occurred some 20 to 30 billion years ago. During this explosion, huge amount of radiation was created. Proton and other nuclei were spread out in large number in all directions with all have high energies. Cosmic ray research covers a very wide field of topics from three research fields, astrophysics, particle and nuclear physics, and geophysics which led to the development of various interdisciplinary fields. Thanks for watching. Notes are available in comment box.